Okay, hello everybody. Andrea back again. I talk about planning and all things lifestyle at this channel. I have changed it a little bit and so I want you guys to take a look at some of the things that I'm doing. I have had some changes over the last couple of years that kept me in the passion planner because I couldn't do my Franklin Anna binder. So this is my Franklin Anna binder and you all probably have seen some work that I've done in here over the last years. At this point, I went back to it because I needed the last three months. So in the Passion Planner, which was fine, it was working out fine for the time of life I needed. And so at the point where this changed, I ended up going back into the Passion. I skipped the Passion Planner and decided to go back into the Franklin Covey. So with that being the case, I also needed some things that I know only are available through Levenger. So today I'm going to show you how, how I'm putting together this. I am not using the Passion Planner anymore because it is a weekly planner. And I can do the weekly planner in my chunky, <laughs> in my chunky um, Anna Binder from Franklin Covey from Franklin Planner. And I do use the Franklin Planner inserts. I use the, right now, right now, I use the Her Point of View. Now, I will stop using this because I love the weekly. So I will be using the weekly as time goes on because this photo is a nu nuisance. So, because I like to, exp you know, uh, expense tracker on here and then take it to the back and put it into my uh, my expense log and my um, tracker so I have my monthly tracker that gives me everything I need where I could not do that in the passion planner I need to have something that I can use for everything. You guys know that I've always said that the Franklin Covey has always been a base and a full program for me. But there are some things that are missing from the Franklin Covey or the Franklin Planner that they used to have. <laughs> and it is called a satellite notebook. Now, the satellite notebook was a notebook that they had available for us to be able to write when we didn't have our planner with us because we can't do this as an everyday carry. I use the classic and I don't want to use the compact because it is too small for me. So I needed something to take the place of the old fashioned Franklin satellite notebook and to be a wallet for me. So what I did is <laughs> I ordered some things, Levenger, that would work for me and take the place of having the same idea that I wanted before. And so this here, I'm going to just go with what I ordered right away to show you now some of the things that I ordered. I'll start with this one here, which I have my list here so that you won't get confused and I won't get confused on what I ordered. Uh, the three by five free leaf ruled pad. Now I thought these were cards and I'm glad they're not. They're actually note sheets and it comes with a total of 50 sheets per and each one of these are reasonably priced plus I got a very good discount. So basically I have uh, 100, 200 and a 250 sheets. Now I'm not going to use these all the time because I was using a notebook and that notebook went out pretty quick. I was using this notebook here and I was carrying it around with me. I mean, literally I was using this notebook a lot and you know, it's a pocket notebook and it works out fine. It just did not have this many pages and that's fine. But I wanted this, this information to be with my Franklin Covey so that I can have all of that together. And the only way that would work is I tear this out. So that didn't work out for me. So I went ahead and bought these in addition to this here, which is called the gateway phone ticket wallet now this is for travel it's for carrying in your purse it's a wallet and it's for putting your 
passport in. So I wanted to show you guys this. I didn't know that this would be the size it is and surprisingly enough this is the exact size I need. This is so beautiful. Look at that. Okay now of course I went ahead and opened it so <laughs> I just went ahead and opened it. I don't want to waste time with you guys opening because this is almost like an unboxing, but this is more of, uh, let me show you what it is. Now it comes with some three by five cards. It only comes with 12 sample cards. I don't have time for that. You can put, uh, it has a to do for, for, for to do things a ruled and a grid. This is not what I need. I needed a notebook that I could use. So let's go into this and show you. I'm going to show you the passport, how this fits inside of it, and how the pen fits inside of it that I use, which is all the time. I use the same pen all the time. So I use the Passion Planner pens. I use the Z Grip pen, and I use the Pilot G2 07 or smaller, and the Erasable Passion Planner. And sometimes I use the friction uh, erasable pens so I tested those in here I love the passion planner erasable pens let's go ahead and move these out of the way because you see what these are this is five pack and that's what this is here and I'm going to show you how this fits now what they gave me is this here that comes in this uh, folder here so we'll leave that there so I can show you how it works I'm going to move these out of the way, but I'm going to show you how these pins go in, which is, oh my goodness, I love it. So, the first thing to recognize is my phone. So, I turn, I have my phone here, and it goes inside of that outside pocket. Awesome. And then it has another outside pocket if you want to put your passport in here. Or, that is so cool. I like that. So, or you can put your passport inside under here. Okay. You can always have everything if you're traveling. Then you have a zipper pocket if you want to put important documents in here when you're traveling. Or when you, you know, you could keep money in here, cash money, whatever you want to keep in here. This needs to be something flat. This is definitely not something for you to be trying to worry about putting coins and stuff because <laughs> that's just going to make it bulky. So let's just talk about the cards. I pulled some cards out to give you an idea because these cards are one, two, three, four, five. But the cards go portrait. They go like this. Okay. So you can have all your cards here. And... You know business cards or whatever you need to have in here then you can have more details or more information or more documentation folded or otherwise inside this secretarial pocket now this is all leather and then this is canvas on the inside and it says it's made in Ch china exclusively for levenger so i have my telephone and I have this back side if I need to. I have another document area down in here or card section in here. Now what's so good about it is they gave you these cards and I asked the sales rep, will these cards, you know, you have these cards, you fill, take one out and then you document it. I don't like that because I don't want to give away cards. Now, if you wanted to write a card have a card for somebody, you know, when you want to leave your large planner at home, you can write down all of your, uh, you know, your errands, things like that. So I figured because of the satellite that I don't understand why Franklin Cover got, Covey got rid of the satellite notebooks. So what I decided to do is find something that could take the place of the satellite. And I think I found the answer. So here we go. This is the free leaf notebook. So I can take this part off because I really like this. So I'm going to go ahead and take this part off. Okay. And it has a very hard card stock in the back. This is hard. So I'm going to put this here. And now there we go. I have my satellite. 
And then, of course, let's just imagine this is money. And I have money back here. So when I'm at the store, or if I'm getting ready to go to the store, or on any errands, I can put the date on here, or I could just say errands. You know, just put errands on there, and then I can put the date, okay? So whatever the date is, I'm just going to say 1031, <laughs> 24. And now I can write anything that I have, I want. Now, if I want to use these cards that they gave for free as part of this uh, service or this booklet wallet, it's a travel gateway phone ticket wallet. That means you have everything you need when you're traveling. You don't have to worry about something not working or trying to keep up with things. You have your travel information you have your passport i think these cards if you buy 300 300 of them they're a good price but basically you can use any card you can use any card you don't need to you don't need to buy theirs i mean they're the exact same size you don't need to buy theirs you can buy some cheap index cards at the store so these cards are a little bit heavier and they have all the information on them. If I can open these up. Oh, so let's go ahead and open these up and see how they would fit if I was to put them someplace else. Now, this is the things to do for that day. You can write those down. Um, then they have the plain ones. Then they have the grid. I don't know what I would use that for, but say for instance, I wanted to just carry a couple of those. I can put them under here and they would be perfect. Okay, so this side is exactly what I need. I'm going to show you how I'm going to use these cards or these sheets when I get ready. Now you can write on the back side as well. So you can write on the back side notes and meetings you know meetings if you have meetings with somebody um you know remember to check um you know reminders <laughs> remember to check reminders okay and so on and so on so these are notes but you want to get these back to your franklin planner later on or your everyday carry so you just stick this under here until you get back home to your main planner so before i show you what i'm going to do with these these uh cards of these sheets because this sheet is more of i would say this is not 80 pounds because i know that i already know that this one is 80 pounds so it's hard for me to tell you guys what things are but i know this is 80 pounds so this is not 80 pounds i would put this at probably a 28 pound but not 80 for sure which i wouldn't want it at 80 because that's that's just too much okay so let's go ahead and keep i have the pen the pens that i normally write with are going to be these i don't need erasable pens in here sometimes i need erasable pens but there's your pen it fits right in there or you can do the z grip medium and then i'm sure when this stretches out it'll be fine and of course I have my G2, Pilot G2. I can put it in there. And then look, it closes so neatly. Let's see if you can see that. This is awesome. And don't forget, I have my passport in here. Or did I put my, nope, I moved my passport to inside. But if I'm traveling, I would put my passport out here and it is very tight. Okay. And I can show it real quick. Now, this would be, you know, anything that has to do with my identification. I can put some change in here, some uh, dollar bills in here. And then, I, or I can put my passport over here. Now, I wouldn't want to stand up there and be trying to pull my passport out with all of this open. I could do it over here if I want to. And then that, of course, I told you there's another opening there. And it's that's it this here is like to me a great wallet because i have notes if i go to the store 
I can write down if I go to the bank what kind of um, if I'm doing any kind of deposits or withdrawals for my budget envelopes and stuff like that you know things like that so that I could keep up with that if I want to I've used two sheets that's not good so that I like I don't like this here so I'll keep this under here for now because I'm not using it and I do not want it out here but I do want my phone so this will fit perfectly in my purse I don't have to worry about carrying my Franklin planner which is a chunky monkey with me everywhere I go now let me show you what I do with these sheets with the Franklin planner now I'll take this out when I'm back home I've done everything I've made some notes if I was out and about I've made some notes I've had a conversation with somebody so I now take my Franklin now let's just put this here so you can see so I'll take my Franklin planner and this is exactly how it used to be when I used the other stuff so now let's take the Franklin planner this is exactly the way I did the satellite notebook so now this is my satellite notebook <laughs> I love it so I have my hole punch for the Franklin planner and all I need to do is put this in here I don't want to put it down at the bottom because it leaves too much of a hole and it's halfway so I'll just put it in the middle and move it down so it'll be organized in a way to where the holes fit if I move it all the way to the top that's just fine as wet fine as well it doesn't really matter where I do it as long as I don't do it at the bottom so now I take this and I am going to put this in here and I've done a couple of them already see I already put them in so they can go with this if I have any additional notes so all I did was take the the document now you can always open this up it doesn't matter you can always open it up now if it has something to do with finances I could take it to my finance section if it had something to do with home I could take it to that and so on and so on or if it has something I want to take care of next month I can put it into the next month section so that I, let me close this so that I will be ready to add anything else in here okay if I wanted to but in my case I want to have these cut so that I could just slide them in so I might go through all of them every once in a while and slide them in that way I don't have to tape anything there just like a disc bound notebook check it out perfect 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 so this goes with me got my phone in here I use my ear pods or earbuds so I don't need to worry about taking my phone out because I have it set to tell me who's calling so this is perfect I love this so now I can leave this at home have this ready for myself when I come back it'll always be or it could be in my uh, book at home my bag at home or in the car so these two with the different sizes this is this is literally like having a nice little satellite notebook and it holds my phone and everything is together okay so now let's go on to our next item that I got you know I I never am this happy with my purchases <laughs> This is the first time I am really happy with my purchase. This, I mean, this is so, I love the way it feels. I have been searching for something for so long to take the place of a satellite notebook. You know, this is, this is really something I have been wanting for a while. I hate that Franklin Covey took away their satellite notebooks or Franklin planner I've been with them for over 30 years let's see over 39 years I got my first Franklin planner in 2000 I mean in 1988 I think or 1990 so now this is awesome I don't you know I could be sitting there and my purse is there and it doesn't have to be taking up so much room I could take no, oh my goodness this is awesome I can have my money and everything in here. This is my wallet. So, oh, 
forgot to put my pen back in there. Don't need to lose my pen. Okay, there we go. That's my wallet. Now that is perfect. So now let me show you my next thing that I did get. And I bought this before, but it was, this is, and I like the way they, they package everything. It's so pretty. Everything is so nice. So I'm just going to rip into this. I don't really care about the paper. I went ahead and got my name on this. And you guys probably have seen this before. But this time they got my name right. And I bought it in. This is called a five-year journal. I know I didn't want to be getting stuff from, you know, I didn't I didn't want to get stuff from Hobonichi. I don't like that kind of paper and stuff. So this is regular paper. I'm going to keep this in boxes and have the years on here. But it is made out of fabric. Let's see if I can show you that. It's fabric. Okay. All right. So here's the... So you just start writing. And I literally am going to start writing right now. I'm not going to wait. I'm just going to write. Uh, start October whatever the date is I'm just gonna start right away I'm not gonna wait till next year and start at the beginning I'll just come here and I'll fill these in with photos from my phone and then I'll come back for 2000 uh, once I get to 2025 I'll start here and I did write some things in my, uh, I can backdate some of these if I want to. I doubt it. But this is awesome. And it has a tie here or whatever you call this uh, thing. There, there we go. <laughs> it's a blue. Oh, that's a pretty color. I, it goes with this. Oh, look at that. And then it has my name initials on it five-year journal in leather with the stitching and everything and the first page the first page is just a you know it's kind of glued of course that's how things are you know you can't expect less it is not stitched it is glued so that doesn't matter because this is only going to be written in one time every day for five years and I really want to do that at first, I wasn't thinking that that would be good, but over the last three years, there's been so many things going on in my life. This would, I feel like I, I feel like I could go back and write things for the last few years, and it would be perfect. So now, the important dates to remember, I think I would write that in pencil. Uh, birthdays, I guess, or days and things that happen important. But basically, at this particular point, I would not wait to start in January. Too many things happen in my life to wait and start. But I would go back uh, probably for 2000, for this year, 2024, and actually backdate some things. Because I know I have a memory. I have a good memory. And plus, I keep a journal. So this would be easy to put that journal together. Go back and take some notes from my passion planner monthly review and i could just add a single page on what because i keep a, i keep a calendar of everything oh let me put this back in here because i don't want to get damaged this is going to go beside my bed and it is going to have a nice a nice um pen with it i'm not going to do any major things in here this is just writing only okay now this is the Softolio 2.0. And the Softolio 2.0 was something I ordered before. And that color, I forgot to tell you, this is in grape. Okay, so, oh, it's so pretty. Look at that. So pretty. Look at that grape. Well, I ordered all grape. I think grape is my color for them. Now, this is the Softolio. Oh, look at that. All right. Now, what I want to do with this one, and this is an interesting concept. I'm not real sure. I want to have a separate notebook. You know, I don't know. I have to think about this one, but I have some ideas because it fits other notebooks other than this one here. And so I want, because of the height and it fits my iPad in here, 
I can have this in my book, in my uh, carry-all bag as well. And that way I could take major notes. But this is the one I would take major notes in. Or even... Jesus, I don't know. I had that in mind and now I can't think. <laughs> I can't really think what I was planning on doing. Oh, that's what I was planning on doing with this. I was planning on having my journal. This would be my notes journal. And my, so this would go like this. And it would go in here. There. That's what I was planning on doing. Just like that. That would be my notes journal. And this journal is full. So let's see here. Okay, there we go. Yeah. This journal is full. That's blog information. Things that have to do with online work that i have so i do patreon and things like that so this would be my online notes and things like that that has to do with my business then it says it fits a mini um ipad now my ipad is way too big for this way too big okay it's too big to fit in here. I'd have to have a mini iPad. And I do not want to have my iPad sitting in here like that. I like my iPad, but it can't sit in there like that. Now, one of you did tell me when I first got one of these Softolios that I was trying to use it the incorrect way. I was stuffing it too much. So now I get it. Okay, I really do get it. I do use my iPad GoodNotes quite a bit and I love it I am going to continue to use it all right this is going to work for me I can put it here and I can put this one on this side yeah I can put that inside of that it won't fit so I, it has to be on this side these are nice I like that I can even put this one over there an iPad on this side but I like writing to the right because I would take the iPad out and use it but this here would be awesome but I have to be careful about that zipper scratching my iPad and it does not have a pin loop I said, oh look at that there's a pin loop on this side but the pin loop would not hold that's a big pin Let's stick to the small pins that I always use. Yeah, I got to make sure I stick to the pins I always use. I don't want to try to get a bigger pin in here because that's not going to work. So we'll just put this little flare in here for now just so you guys can see. Oh, here they are. I would most likely use the erasable in here. There we go. Or I would use a pin that has... Uh, I really wish I could find the refills for this. This pen here was the pen I used forever from Franklin Covey. And I cannot find the refills for it at all. At all. I have, I have tried and I have written the person for it. So this here was the jam. So, you know, just one of those things. That was the pen for me. I just, I mean, I might get a pen from Levenger that'll take the place of this one. This is so beautiful. Okay, so anyway, right now I'll just stick with these kind of pens. They are, they are hard, but I hate the everyday pens. I like the pens that had that four. Okay, so there we go. That's how I would use it. With the exception of putting this inside. And I don't even need to have these with free leaf because this is a notebook. Alright, so that would be a journal. And I would put this in here. Because I do not want to lose that. Alright, there we go. Either way I go, that works. Now, this would not go in my purse like a regular planner because if you think about it, this is a planner too. And it is literally the same size. So, 
literally the same size so the only thing it would be is something to carry my iPad and a little note section that's it that's it that's all it would be it's just for my notepad or my iPad and if I can get that smaller iPad I'd be I would be set but I don't think that's a I don't think that's a useful way of using my funds so so at this particular point we're going to just leave that the way it is okay so that's it turn that over and close it and we're good so I'm ready for this let's go ahead and put this back in because why not all right because I can of course write notes on here and then put them into my planner when I come back home there we go all right I think that was it you guys seen it you seen everything now I'm not a fond of these discs but I use the disc for other things so I'm not gonna worry about showing that to you but I just want you to see that so let's go ahead and go over Let's go over what I got we got oh these are so cute oh look at that oh just awesome love that and of course this here is gonna always stay at home now because it has my it has everything in here everything this is how I keep up with this is this is <laughs> spot central and I am going to be changing this to weekly and that's how I'm going to do that um I really was hoping that this book here fit the passion planner but it's off by a tad so I would have to get the passion planner that's this size and if I did that I would use the passion planner that's this size because they're all the same size this is just their journal I would definitely do that in case, instead of using this all the time and if that's the case this is all I need this would be all I need and that would be perfect kind of perfect I'll keep you posted on what I do with that but for now we're just going to keep these things out so you can see what I got so we got the Softolio 2.0 the gateway phone wallet which is now my wallet then we have the five-year journal which is now my evening journal this came with an extra notebook in the softolio i'm not going to use it maybe somebody might want it you're welcome to have it or i don't think i better give away things right now <laughs> uh so yeah that's it so we'll just uh take a picture of this and that way you guys can see this on the thing there there we go all right yay okay so that is the levenger unboxing i appreciate you guys for following me and i think you if you have any questions or any comments please leave them in the comment section that's it that's the best i'm going to do <laughs> all right you guys have a, day, a good day evening and afternoon i hope this video was helpful for you to see how i use and what i added to my arsenal I got a journal now, a wallet, and some place to carry my iPad. I don't know if that's going to work very well, but hey, for now, we're going to do it like that. Okay? And then I'll be able to keep my Franklin Planner, which is my, this is my Life Central right here. I'll be able to keep this at home, and it will go into, like everything else, it will go into my bag, and I'll show you that more later but this is awesome i can put everything in here i don't need these i'll store these and i'll just have my journal in here this goes into my purse and then this goes into here everything fits that's how i carry everything around the house so i can sit down and work and and watch tv that is my care i'll tell you guys more about this later so anyway We'll, we'll go ahead and move on from that. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I appreciate you guys who have been here subscribing with me for so long. That is so awesome. I know I haven't been getting any changes. Okay. Talk to you later. Bye.